Good afternoon, let's make today's video portfolio update. Uh, so here we have it, it is down 1.55%, unfortunately 1.43% now and uh, all five holdings are going down. I'm going to make some changes. The portfolio is still up 11% since inception. Uh, just uh, 25 days ago on Ju June 1st 2007 this is our daily chart since inception but uh, well gains have stalled a bit here and I'm gonna make some changes today let's move on to the individual holdings ACH it was up a bit when I'm when I updated this chart it is down now but I'm going going to keep holding this one also INSW correcting a bit it was up more than 14 percent in these two days so this is a normal correction profit taking day with very low volume of just 8,000 shares or so so I'm gonna keep this one too and IDAC I thought about selling it but um, I checked fundamentals again and the stock seems really attractive and trading way below its industry peers valuation uh, so I can sell it with such a small profit I have just let me see here just 8% uh, profit here so I'm gonna keep it for some more time and uh, this one unfortunately I'm gonna sell it MCZ at uh, the price I'm going to put is today's closing price uh, sorry for this just a second okay sorry for this uh, so where w was I okay insiders sold shares here in the 160 area they sold about half a million dollars worth of shares and the stock went down because of it but it is trading it just touched the ascending support today I believe it will rebound but uh, longer term I, I'm not a big fan of the business uh, I explain it in MCZ thread uh, due to competitive reasons and uh, well so my option is will I wait for a rebound here or will I sell it right now and change for switch for another stock well I'm going to switch for another one that I know very well too so this will be out at today's closing price MCZ and uh, SLT well another disappointment uh, as I've been studying more of the stock and some friends brought a few articles about it it seems prospects are, aren't as rosy as I had. They were very optimistic. The, I, I just made an extrapolation of recent fundamental trends, but the future doesn't seem so so compelling, you know, because revenue growth I had. First, I had 75% in my valuation model because the last two, two years growth was 90%. So I had 75%. Then I've reduced it to 50% but now it seems it should be 10 to 15% due to commodity prices are flattening out and so just 10 to 15% here and uh, I'm gonna think one more day about this and uh, tomorrow I'll decide if I'll sell it or hold it and uh, the stock I'm going to add today to the video portfolio at uh, today's closing price is this Eternal Technologies ticker symbol is etlt.ob this is an otcbb traded stock so if you if you're risk very risk averse don't don't buy this one uh, this is just a 31 million market cap you know, according to its 10k uh, published uh, for for the uh, q1 2007 the company has 40 million plus in cash and short-term investments and it is just a 31 million market cap so trading below cash revenues are growing 78 percent from the year ago levels and uh, but uh, I've held this stock in the past and, and uh, this was true before and the stock didn't rise it's incredible it came off to the 200 days moving average and now it is reacting very well to the 50 days support and the 200 days I like this chart a lot volume is also higher it is higher now than what it was when I, I updated the chart 
and the company announced today that it will buy back 5% of its outstanding shares and uh, perhaps that will be the catalyst for everybody to see that this stock is trading at five times earnings so it is probably one of the cheapest stocks out there in the market and uh, it may very well double so I'm gonna give it a chance and add it today but uh, the stock needs to run and run over the next few days or else I'll probably sell it out again so I'm a, a bit of a weak hand but uh, I'm going to give it a second chance. Uh, thanks. Bye. See you tomorrow.